So this is um, page 49 and you can see here a call center. <laughs> no, of course it's not. Um, it is a picture from 1899 and on the right you can see probably a teacher feeding books into a machine that is then taking all the books and putting them into people's brains via some headphones. Um, is this the way we learn now? I don't think so. Is it the way that we could learn in the future? Who knows? There's a quote at the top. People who live in the past should not decide the course of the future. What do you think of that? Um, you know, can you think of any politicians or any people that uh, fit that category? People that think about the past and the history and things that they, their parents' generation don't even remember. Um, yeah, should we all look forwards? All right, why do people often fear the future, it says down at the bottom. Um, let's face it, we've just turned into the new year. There is a vaccine on the way. We've started badly, but things can only get better, can't they? Surely. Okay, let's move on to page 50. Actually, let's not move on to page 50 quite yet, because um, at the bottom of the page it says watch the video introduction, and of course you can find these videos on the Headway website. You can find them on the Headway online practice and uh, resources and you'll find the video introductions for each one. So um, yeah, a future perfect. Welcome to Unit 5. This unit looks at various aspects of the future and the things people hope for and look forward to. You talk about what's going to happen and how you can make changes for the next generation. Okay, and if you haven't guessed what the grammar's going to be, then um, there's no helping you. Okay, let's move on to the next page. So, page 50. Let's have a look at future forms at the top here. And it says situations one to eight all contain a future form. Match them to their meanings. So don't worry, you'll pass the exam. I'm seeing Joe for lunch on Friday. The train to Dover leaves at 10. Shall we have a break now? Oh, should I get a message now? <laughs> I'm going to go on a diet. I'll make some coffee. We will have finished by Friday. And this time tomorrow, yawn, I will be lying on the beach. Yes, future continuous in its classic form. Sorry, I'll laugh at this one later when I explain it and probably give you a better explanation, I hope. Okay, I'm going to pause it now. Have a look at the things on the right, okay? Um, check any vocabulary you need. And um, if you press pause now, I'm going to put up the answers in five, four, three, two, one and here they are we've got a prediction an arrangement a timetable a suggestion an intention a spontaneous decision the past from the future and a future action in progress wow okay can you name all of those can you name the different future forms you know so we've got future simple and future continuous and blah 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 all these things okay they've all got names <laughs> Although one or two of them are not great names like going to. Let's have a look at those answers from the bottom. Uh, I'm not going to put you through the torture of naming them, but you can. You can put rest pause, of course, and then here come the answers. Okay. Future simple. Will plus the infinitive. Sorry, will plus the infinitive. Yes. Sorry. So I will do something. We've got present continuous that we can use about plans in the future. We've got present simple about things that affect anybody or everybody every day, such as timetables. We've got shall for suggestions. Shall I do something? Don't forget there's no to do with modal verbs like will or shall. Then we've got the going to form plus the infinitive. Um, then we've got this recording is going to, uh, oh, it says will end. He's threatening me. It's formal language. Yes, it's going to finish very soon. Okay. Uh, we have future simple, future perfect and future continuous. Okay. Future perfect. We're going forward to a point where we're going to be looking back. Okay, <laughs> I'll stop now and the next video will come up in just a moment. I hope.